Uh, it's Kareel here, and I just wanted to tell you a quick backstory about um, my song with a child now. Uh, so now has been on for how long? Three years, guys. Three, three whole years. Uh, let me start by saying how much of an honor it was for me to get featured on that song because I, I remember I remember three years ago nobody knew me to be an artist I was mostly producing for other people because that's what I do I'm a producer uh, an engineer producer director uh, so I was mostly doing that for virtually everybody and no I wasn't doing anything for myself but regarding music I wasn't doing anything regarding music uh, so yeah I reached out to him and was like, okay, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. And then he sent me a verse. That was like two days after, or three. I remember he said he had a session and then he went to the studio, sent me a video of him trying to record and all that. I wish I had it. I wish I had it. It's been a while though. I wish I had a video. It was, it was, it was a very, it was a very, very good moment for me. Cause like, I mean, I wasn't getting features at that time. It was, it was one of my first international features ever. Yeah, uh, so I, I got the song to a place where I was okay with it. I sent it to him and then he sent it back to me. I was like, okay, how about we just double this part and make here like this and make there like that. I was like, okay, that can work also. And then I did it and then I kept adding things and taking things. I was like, oh, blah. Because I knew everything that makes you start layering things over and over again on a song just not in a review to put out that song you know so that's what it felt like at the time being and i was like you know what let me just move on to other things and then put it on when i'm ready uh, yeah uh, uh, and then i i remember a year later i was like yo bro that song we put out how far so i was like okay when i'm ready i should just let him know and then uh, I listened to this song again, I was like, no, this is not a sound. I'm not okay with it. This is not what I represent right now, because uh, I was trying to, you know, have a particular way of uh, my sound being represented across board. Anyway, here, you know, so yeah, I sent it out to him again. He was like, okay, let's, let's go. And then it went quiet again, because I wasn't getting what I, he didn't do I had done like five different beats for that song. <laughs> this was 2021. Uh, yeah, sort of. Then this year again. No. Yeah, I think it was end of 2020. He texted me. He was like, you, I understand that it's okay not to feel something you did a while ago. Just let me know if you're not ready to put it out anymore so I can see if we can do something new. You can get tired of the sound and then you probably outgrew it as well. I was like, oh, don't worry, you put it out. Really. Yeah. And then I went back again and did like three more beats on the song that I wasn't feeling it at all till about uh, three months ago. I came back to the song again and um, look at God. God is so good. And then I, I got the exact vibe I was looking for. Exact vocal chops, I had to sample them again and then, yeah, I made the beat over again and then that's, nobody knows this, but that song has eight beats I've made for it, at least eight different versions of it done. That's how special it is to me and um, I just wanted to ask for a favor that you help me receive it right now. Uh, help me head to the link on my bio and then catch that song. Please save it and I'll see you on the 28th. Please show for Charles some love. Just tag him below, tell him all the nicest things you can. Give him his power, man. He's been very patient with me. <laughs> He's been very patient with me and I, I don't take that for granted. Love you guys. See you on the 28th. Boom. Faith. Faith.